is our second one that we've come across in just a short period of time. There somewhere looming out there is this greasy monster. We're going to check all the goings on on the beach. Stick around, let's see what we got. Tom McPhee's? This isn't Tom McPhee's story. That's pretty arrogant. I said, it's absolutely uniquely my story. Nobody could have told this story but me. Keep moving faster, though. Let's get around. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's find stuff that nobody else is finding. It's just being washed into this area right here. And he doesn't look like he's in too good a shape. I'm Tom McPhee with the World Animal Awareness Society. You know, you talk about puppy mills, and let's talk about that for a second. A lot of these animals came from horrible situations. You've been out and about now. What do you think is going to be the impact? We all have to do more. I wanted to understand the whole story. This human-animal intersection, we can, we can witness our evolution. Ann Arbor photojournalist Tom McPhee is going back to the growing catastrophe in the Gulf. He is the executive director of the World Animal Awareness Society. You have this enormous amount of oil that's going to affect all of this area, but it is. It's slow moving. It's just getting there. And we've been watching this story since the 20th of, of April, and I think people get tired of it after a while. And what they don't understand is it's just beginning for the wildlife. Under you, and I'll be number one, and you'll just be what happened to. 